for Massa. It was the merest strands of hair on a girl adept at daylight that were wayward signs to these infernal men. Their sight set on those tresses deemed impure, head equals harlot, they inferred. They never saw the human. Female, woman, whole, ambitious, kind, it mattered not to them. Those praetors of flesh policing every woman's breath that they could get away with. Their deeds as lowly as their words unconscionable. Each insult, brick, and kick they hurled at her for this imagined slight against their honor, a projection of their virulent insides. They were but dogs to her. Barbaric, brutal, bludgeoning, they could not bear her light. And with their rape and fury at their spirit, snuffed it out. The most malicious way to go. The taking of a life for daring to be girl. At her last breath, the women of Iran, pain in their breast of another fallen sister, surged. Her flat line electrified their cries of Azad D. Masa no longer mortal, beyond flesh she is idea. And as she laid in wake, each woman fated to accept a state as bleak took to the streets. Hair unbound, fists raised, and bodies free. Her fallen light, their fire, as they set alight hijabs. They will no longer be kowtowed. She is a symbol of enough to every woman of the world now and through her unjust execution that shook the world now dawns their revolution sisters your time is now thank you victoria